Ser feliz nunca me ha salido caro guys it's alina and today i'm going to be filming a collective haul i have bought so 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 many things since march and i i have a lot of stuff that i want to show you guys so we're going to get right into the video i think i'm just going to start off with all of the bottoms that i have purchased so the first one i purchased three pairs of jeans from american eagle i think the day that i purchased them they were there was some type of sale going on i don't remember i bought them such a long time ago so the first pair of jeans that i purchased they are called the next level super high waisted jegging these i'm not gonna lie i purchased these because i saw aslia william wearing them and i really liked how they looked on her so i ended up going ahead and purchasing these i really like the placement of the ribs and i also like that it's super stretchy and so when you have very very big thighs all of these little things they typically rip as soon as you like put them on but these since they're stretchy i've been wearing these for a few months already and they haven't ripped yet and i still have the perfect design so the next pair of jeans that I purchased is the, these are called the Next Level Curvy High Waist, the Jegging. And so these are plain, they literally don't have any rips or anything. I bought them because I had a pair that looked just like this and I ended up getting a rip right in between my thighs and I needed another pair of plain jeans for work. So there's not very much to see here, they're just plain. And the last pair of jeans that I purchased from American Eagle were the Stretch mom jeans i actually got these for free they used to have this thing where it was like buy five pairs of jeans and then you get one free and i ended up getting a free pair of jeans out of that so i really like the shade of blue and i also like the distressing it's also a looser fit on the bottom these are probably the most comfortable jeans that i own the only thing is you can probably see that i have it tied up in the back i have a very small waist and i'm usually a size two in american eagle jeans but any of their jeans that are not jeggings like the mom jeans and the boyfriend jeans the girlfriend jeans they don't fit me on my waist so i have this tied up when i'm wearing a black shirt it works i have not worn it with any other color yet so so the next pair of bottoms that i ordered was two pairs of biker shorts i do not own any biker shorts yet but now i do i ordered these in gray and i'm also wearing the black ones um the black ones i find there were they were two different styles because they didn't have the black ones that i ordered in a gray shade so they're a little bit different in terms of how they fit this you can see that the torso i mean like this middle section is very long so they fit a little bit differently but regardless they're both super super comfortable the last thing that i purchased was these pair of gray shorts they're super basic but extremely extremely comfortable i wore them to bed last night the only thing that I don't like about them is that these strings are extremely long for no reason, as you'll probably see in the um, clip that I'm about to record. So now I'm going to get into the tops that I ordered from Shein. The first thing that I ordered was this gray crop top. I really wanted like a slim fit crop top, if that makes sense, that I could wear with high-waisted ripped jeans if I wanted to in the summertime. And summer's almost over, but I'm very happy that I was able to pick this up. I also picked up these i don't even know they're like tank tops but they're kind of racer back if that makes sense i got the same thing in both black and white because i like to have my basics in two different colors usually black and white gray and white gray and black so this i really like it i was not expecting it to be this texture it's kind of like a more silky like breathable cool fit does that even make any sense it's kind of like the active wear fabric that people wear. It was not in the active section, but it's like an active wear fabric that I feel like it would be really nice and cool in the summertime. So the last thing that I purchased from Shein was this purple bikini top. I have not worn this this summer. I probably won't wear it until next summer because summer is over. I really like the style of it. It was also really, really cheap and it fit me perfectly. I like this little V cut that it has in the middle. The last store that I'm going to get into is PacSun. All of this clothing from PacSun, I purchased it back in April around my birthday. And so the first thing that I'm going to be showing is this white Brixton custom quality shirt. The funny part about this shirt is that I purchased it in April and I have not worn it yet but it's not because i don't like it it's just that i don't have anywhere to wear it too it's really hot outside but hopefully i'll be able to wear it this fall um i really like the color scheme of this i bought this shirt specifically with the purpose of wearing it with my yellow vans and so i just thought the combination would be good but i have not worn it yet 
So if you guys know me, I am a sucker for graphic tees. So from PacSun, I got two more graphic tees to add to my collection. The first one is this tie-dye t-shirt that says Hulk Worldwide in the middle. It is kind of like purple, white. Um, there's a little bit of blue. It also has a very oversized fit. It's very, very long on me because it's from the men's section. But I really just like the color scheme and the vibe. You can literally pair this with white vans, gray vans, Air Force Ones, and it will look great. This is the last shirt that I purchased from PacSun. This was probably my favorite piece of clothing that I have purchased in the last few months. I am in love with the brand Santa Cruz. For some reason, I have a lot of t-shirts that have this brand on it. It has this little wave design here in the corner that I found really cute and I feel like it complements the yellow t-shirt so well and it also has the same design on the back. The other thing that I got from PacSun was this, um, I got a six pack of crew socks. I do like wearing these under sweatpants in the winter time. So this came with a gray, white, and a gray, white, and black, um, two pairs of each. So I'm excited to wear these during the winter time. So now I'm going to get into some of the jewelry that I purchased from Shein. I'm sure this jewelry is going to turn brown in the next few weeks, but it's fine. So the first thing that I got were, this is a three-piece anklet set. I only ordered this because I wanted to get to $50 so that I could get free shipping. And so um, I was not able to wear them this summer yet either, but I know next summer I'll definitely wear them. So there's just a little one that has a butterfly on it. And... There's, there's an anklet that has butterflies all around them, and then the middle one is just chain links, and then the last one is just a little basic anklet. I don't have very much gold jewelry, especially like for church. I do like to wear a lot of necklaces, bracelets, things like that for church. So I just got a little basic layered gray neck, I mean gold necklace that I feel like would match with a lot of my Sunday pieces. And I got something else that's very similar, but it's more, um, it has a little... What is that called? Like a pendant or something on the end? I don't know. Okay, I think that this is how it's supposed to go. But I also really like this one. I got it for the same reason. I don't have any gold jewelry. I also really like how this is layered. It's a little bit longer than the other one because it has like the pendants and stuff falling from it. I also got this necklace that says 2001, which is the year I was born. Um, I feel like this is a very basic necklace that you can wear with literally everything. I am not used to wearing necklaces with like hoodies, t-shirts, and stuff like that, but I really wanted to get into doing that. I also got this butterfly necklace that you guys saw in my last video, which if you haven't watched it, you should go do that. But it's just this butterfly necklace. I think that it's really, really pretty. The deal, The detailing is so crazy. And then the last thing that I got was these earrings. Um... Ever since I got my cartilage piercings removed, I always like to have like a fake earring on here and I just like clip it on like this, but it came with a gray, I mean, it came with a silver, rose gold, and a regular gold earring. And so I really like to wear these, um, you know, just to make me feel better about myself. The next thing is not a clothing item, however, um, I was obsessed with it when I purchased it. So it's this um, small Herschel backpack. I actually got it on sale. I think the original price was almost... It was either almost $30 or $40 and I got it for $20. One of my dreams has always been to own a Herschel backpack. The picture for some reason it looked a lot smaller than the backpack actually is. But it is very spacious inside. Um, I've taken it places already and i like it a lot we are almost done so the last two things that i purchased were pairs of shoes and the first one i'm going to be showing you guys is this gray pair of slip on vans i was literally so excited about these because i do own a pair of skate high gray vans but i never wore them and i always thought that it was because of the color but it turns out that it's actually just the style of the shoe i have worn these gray vans with so many different outfits and I didn't realize that the style of the shoe could affect an outfit so much. So I was very happy that I picked these up in gray. I wanted to save the best for last. This is hands down my favorite shoe that I have ever purchased in my entire life. I am just a little bit of a sneakerhead, just a tad. And I ended up picking these up. These, I think they're called 
the alpha type ones something like that i think but they are so unique i have not seen anybody with them yet i think that i'm like one of the first people that i've seen with them but i really like these because first of all it has a lot of neon this inside looks like this and it does not glow in the dark i always get questions about that it does not glow in the dark but it does look really nice really clean this is like a little velcro thing that it comes off and then the front kind of has like little circles on it that i really like a lot and it's the tongue is like also very soft and flexible and i just love the detailing like the shoe is just amazing so i also did get these on sale i had them open in my cart for months and months and months and months because i was waiting for the price to go down and i ended up getting them for i think like 80 dollars instead of 120 or 130 so i was very happy about that so well, that is it for this video if you enjoyed it please make sure to give it a thumbs up comment down below what's next and subscribe to my channel subscribe and down below along with all of my social media links my instagram my twitter my vseo and my spotify playlist and i will see you guys next week